know when he when he was like he was talking normal and everything um which i thought was kind of odd considering the boy had freaking got a nail jammed in his hand like shot through his hand basically and um how how can you remain so calm in a situation like that you know i don't know especially for me he was my age at the time and i know i was for a fact in elementary school i just don't know what grade so he was in elementary school too <laughs> but um i know after that happened we went back to well no we went back we went inside and i was like guys i don't feel too good and then you know i'm, I'm a little drama queen and little me younger me i was oh man i was a little <laughs> i needed all attention on me i guess i don't know and so we go inside and we my sister's like talking to him and everything and then i'm just like oh yeah i don't feel good and i go to the restroom right
of course, because I had just passed out, and there was this one lady who offered me this little apple juice box, and it was like so nostalgic to me because I haven't had one of those little cute apple juice boxes in a long ass time, probably since I was like a little kid. But but I was just sitting there, I felt like a little a little kid again, just sipping my juice box with all these doctors around me, making sure I was okay. Special. I felt important. <laughs> not, that's not really good, but uh, not the point. Um, but um, yeah, that happened, and <laughs> oh my gosh, <laughs> and yeah, one. Once that happened, we still had to be in there and still had to wait for the um, woman to give me, what for them to, we still had to wait for them to draw the blood. So, we're sitting in there and of course they give me a minute to compose myself because I was still kind of like there and not there, if that makes sense. And so... Charles. 
for you and that's that so I'm going to put the glass put the glass over you I'm going to use the glass video don't be surprised or in this video 